My friends, wake up. I know that in your dreams you see the way the world should be, but we breathe in reality. Your sleep, it won't stay peaceful, even through a whisper of evil, and there is evil in the minds of sleeping people. Wake up. It's slipping through our fingers. The ability for civility because clenched fists don't know what they're fighting for. It's not love. Wake up. There you go. Now rub that sleep from your eyes. Arise and reply to those cries. Tell them why we despise the lies of a hateful enterprise. Tell them that dream where nobody dies and no one gets hurt and no one feels the emotional pain of being told that they are not the same. Tell them we share 99.9% .9 of our DNA so we don't know them by difference, we know them by name or friend. And I would face my fears for the friends that I love because love is an infinite blanket. I will pick apart the positive pieces of my past so that I can remember to thank it because every single little bit of little brittle love in life could turn the world into a banquet. But this is not for the weak. It's easy to sleep. This takes strength because the heart is just a muscle and humans, we make mistakes, but it's time to heal. Too long have we reacted to the things that we feel and it's not true to who's inside us because we've all had bad thoughts, but they don't have to define us. It's time to trust that difference is not a threat to us no matter what it takes because food for hate is what fear makes, but you, TEDx Perth, are awake. So let's make a loud alarm clock on the dawn of this new day, a harm block for the new way with arms locked, standing strong, because this world does have wrong, but two are not right. We will end dark nights with sunlight to wake the world from sleep, because love is our weapon and we are armed to our teeth, and we will change the world with the words that we speak. Just wake up and make so much noise that no one can sleep. Thank you.